Sponsorem programu jest PKN Orlen, mecenas 18 Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Wielkie chwile i wspólne emocje podczas 18 Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Totalizator sportowy, największy mecenas sportu i kultury. Grupa PZU partnerem 18 Konkursu Chopinowskiego. Wspierać kulturę to piękna sztuka. Sponsorem programu jest właściciel marki Lexus, partner Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Sponsorem programu jest fabryka cukiernicza Kopernik, partner 18 Konkursu Chopinowskiego. Miraculum SA, official partner and exclusive producer of Chopin Perfumes, has the pleasure of inviting you to the Chopin competition.
gali wręczenia nagród w koncercie laureatów 18 Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego im. Fryderyka Chopina, Agata Konarska i Aleksander Laskowski. Agata Witamy Konarska Państwa bardzo Aleksander serdecznie. Aleksander Laskowski. Welcome so warmly. Serdecznie witamy prezydenta Welcome. We'd like to welcome Mr. Andrzej Duda and the First Lady of Poland. Witamy senatorów i posłów oraz przedstawicieli We welcome the senators, members of the Polish Parliament and representatives of the government of the Republic of Poland. Witamy przedstawicieli korpusu. May we welcome representatives of the diplomatic corps. We welcome the TV viewers from Polish TV1 and TVP Kultura. We welcome the audience of Polish Radio 2 and those who watch the YouTube channel of Friedrich Chopin Institute all around the world. And may we welcome all of you ladies and gentlemen gathered here in the Teatr Wielki Polish National Opera in Warsaw. Thank you very much for being with us. May we invite to the stage the jury of the 18th Chopin competition as we are opening the official ceremony of the prize presentation. May we invite to the stage the president of the jury, Ms. Katarzyna Popowa-Zydroń. And members of the jury, Ms. Sa Chen. Pan Dang Tai Song. Mr. Dang Tai Song. Pani Akiko Ebi. Ms. Akiko Ebi. Pan Philippe Giusiano. Ms. Philippe Giusiano. Pan Nelson Gerner. Mr. Nelson Gerner. Pan Adam Harasiewicz. Mr. Adam Harasiewicz. Pan Krzysztof Jabłoński. Mr. Krzysztof Jabłoński. Pan Kevin Kenner. Mr. Kevin Kenner. Pan Artur Moreira Lima. Mr. Artur Moreira Lima. Pan Janusz Olejniczak. Mr. Janusz Olejniczak. Pan Piotr Paleczny. Mr. Piotr Paleczny. Pani Ewa Pobłocka. Ms. Ewa Pobłocka. Pan John Ring. Mr. John Ring. Pan Wojciech Świtała. Mr. Wojciech Świtała. Pani Dina Joffe. Ms. Dina Joffe. Powitajmy również gorąco dyrektora konkursu. Let's welcome the director of the competition very warmly. Mr. Artur Szklener is with us. Na scenę zapraszamy. May we invite to the stage the winners and those participants who reached the finals of the 18th Chopin competition. Ms. Eva Gevorgian, Russia. Pan Hugh Lee, Korea Południowa. Mr. Hugh Lee, South Korea. Pan Kamil Pacholec, Polska. Mr. Kamil Pacholec from Poland. Pan Hao Zhao, Chiny. Mr. Hao Zhao from China. Pan J.J. Jun Lee Bui, Canada. Mr. J.J. Jun Lee Bui, Canada. Pani Leonora Armellini, Włochy. Ms. Leonora Armellini from Italy. Pani Aimi Kobayashi, Japonia. Ms. Aimi Kobayashi from Japan. Pan Jakub Kuszlik, Polska. 
Mr. Jakub Kuschlik from Poland. Pan Martin Garcia Garcia, Hispania. Mr. Martin Garcia Garcia from Spain. Pan Alexander Gadziev, Włochy, Słowenia. Mr. Alexander Gadziev from Italy, Slovenia. Pan Kyohei Sorita, Japonia. Mr. Kyohei Sorita from Japan. Pan Bruce Liu, Canada. Mr. Bruce Liu from Canada. Those are our magnificent finalists, and now it is with great pleasure that I would like to welcome the funders with special prizes, Mr. Wojciech Nowak, Director of the Warsaw Philharmonic. Mrs. Agnieszka Kamińska, President of the Polish Radio. Mr. Andrzej Kosowski, Representative of Christian Zimmermann. Ladies and gentlemen, we are so pleased uh, to welcome the funders of special prizes and honorable mentions. Uh, Mrs. Aldona Magnowska Góra, Deputy Mayor of the, capital, uh, of the capital city of Warsaw, representative of the Mayor of the capital city of Warsaw, funder of the sixth prize, and four honorable mentions. Mr. Marcin, Marcin Przedacz, Deputy Minister of Foreign Affairs, on behalf of the Minister of Foreign Affairs, the funder of the fifth prize. Professor Piotr Gliński, Deputy Prime Minister, Minister of Culture, National Heritage and Sport, funder of the fourth prize. Mrs. Małgorzata Gosiewska, Deputy Speaker of the same representative of the funder of the second prize. We would like uh, to welcome everyone very much cordially, and I would like to give the floor to Professor Piotr Glinski, Deputy Prime Minister, Minister of Culture, Natural Heritage and Sport. Deputy Prime Minister, ladies and gentlemen, it's difficult to believe that this is uh, the great uh, holiday of music that we have been waiting for for six years is coming to its fruition, the 18th International um, Piano Competition of uh, Frédéric Chopin has uh, left its uh, um, golden or platinum letters in the history of Poland, but also in the history of uh, music all over the world. This is a wonderful gala of the winners, and this is a very special time, time of drawing conclusions and also thanks. Um, as, as this has been a record holder type of competition, the highest level of pianists, and um, as many as 12 uh, uh, finalists uh, um, have uh, taken part in the finals, and six of them have uh, become winners of the competition. This is a great, remarkable achievement of these young people, and uh, the entire group of pianists uh, was uh, 80 young musicians, but also we have enjoyed record high audience all over the world. Dozens of millions of uh, viewers and listeners have been following this uh, Chopin competition all over the world, and this is a great merit of all the participants and organizers, and I should say of, um, uh, of the entire country of musical Poland, and as far as the words of thank you are concerned, they will be somewhat longer, because I would like to thank uh, all of those who have contributed to such an efficient organization of this competition in this very much demanding time. Unfortunately, we uh, had to organize uh, this competition a year later, but uh, with a very good result. And first and foremost, I would like to thank Mr. President. I would like to thank Mr. President for extending his uh, auspices of this um, competition. I would like to thank Mr. President for funding the first prize. And he is here with us tonight at this award gala. I also would like to thank 
The jury, the members of the jury of this competition, chaired by Professor Katarzyna popova -Zydroń. Undoubtedly, the jury has had a very demanding task, but the jury has um, um, done really well, and um, in fact, this is the jury that is the most responsible body in such an important undertaking as the World Tour Piano Competition, so we would like to extend and our deepest gratitude to the members of the jury. Thank you ever so much for your hard work, but more than that, this is the sense of mission, the sense of dedication uh, to, um, um, to our great composer Chopin, has uh, many followers and you could definitely see it in the work of the best world specialists in Chopin who have uh, shared their responsibilities. I also would like to thank the sponsors, without the sponsors, without those who have supported our competition and uh, without the funders of the uh, prizes we could not have, we would not have been able to organize this competition. And then next, um, I also would like to thank, although everything depends uh, on uh, the director, uh, Dr. Arthur Schlener, and I would like to thank the entire team, the entire staff of the National Institute, of the National Friedrich Chopin Institute. I also would like to thank all those institutions, organizations, and persons who have contributed to the very effective and efficient organization of this competition. Thank you so much. And finally, I would like to thank all our partners, uh, all our organizational partners, um, uh, financial partners, um, substantial partners, other partners without whom this competition uh, would not have taken place. And uh, last but not least, uh, many great thanks to the 80 plus young people who have um, been taking the stage and it is due to them this competition has been so great. would like to thank the wonderful, magnificent young pianists, but especially would like to thank the winners and we're going to thank and enjoy our winners and uh, uh, laureates. Um, those are the young people who bring forth Chopin, his music, and um, those are the people who, sp uh, who spread and present uh, the greatest achievements uh, of uh, music in the world, and uh, undoubtedly this evening shall be the evening of wonderful experiences, so I would like to thank you very much for these beautiful, most beautiful moments and experiences. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, uh, Prime Minister. Thank you, Deputy Prime Minister. And now the time has come to, for the presentation of special awards. I would like to invite uh, uh, Professor, um, uh, uh, Professor Popova Zedroń and also um, Professor Artur Sklener, the director of the Institute of uh, Friedrich Chopin Institute. So, ladies and gentlemen, we are moving on to the first special award, a prize for the best... Um, um, uh, the Warsaw Philharmonic Prize of uh, 5,000 euros for the best performance of a concerto, the award, and uh, Mr. Novak Wojciech, director of the Warsaw Philharmonic, will present the award, and the award goes to, to Martin Garcia Garcia. The special prize, the Polish Radio Prize of 5,000 euros for the best performance of Mazurkas. And uh, Mrs. Agnieszka Kaminska, president of the Polish Radio, will present the award. And the award goes to Jakub Kuszlik. And now, 
the Christian Zimmermann Prize of 10,000 euros for the best performance of a sonata. And Mr. Andrzej Kosowski, a representative of Mr. Christian Zimmermann, will present the award. And we are very pleased to say that the award goes to Alexander Gadiev. Ladies and gentlemen, the time has come for the presentation of honorable mentions funded by the mayor of the capital city of Warsaw. Equal honorable mentions of 4,000 euros for the finalists will be presented by Mrs. Aldona Machnowska Gura, deputy mayor of the capital city of Warsaw. And the honorable mentions go to Eva Georgian, Russia. Mr. Hugh Lee, South Korea. Pan Kamil Pacholec, Polska. Mr. Kamil Pacholec from Poland. Mr. Hao Zhao from China. Congratulations, ladies and gentlemen. It's time for the main prizes awarded by the jury of the 18th Chopin competition in Warsaw. The sixth prize and 7,000 euros from the mayor of Warsaw will be presented by Aldona Machnowska Gura, deputy mayor. And the sixth prize goes to Mr. J.J. Junli Bui from Canada. The fifth prize of 10,000 euro from the Minister of Foreign Affairs will be presented by Mr. Marcin Przydacz, Under Secretary of State. And this prize goes to Ms. Leonora Armelini, Italy. The fourth prize and 15,000 euros from the Minister of Culture, National Heritage and Sport. This prize will be presented by Professor Piotr Gliński, Deputy Prime Minister and Minister of uh, Culture and Sport. And this prize goes to two people who draw for the fourth prize. The first of them is Aimi Kobayashi from Japan. and Mr. Jakub Kuschlik from Poland.
Ladies and gentlemen, dear guests, time for the presentation of the top three prizes. The recipients will receive medals, bronze for the third prize, silver for the second, and gold for the first prize. It is time for the third prize. The medals were designed by Professor Hanna Jelonek. The third prize, funded by the President of the Council of Ministers and the Minister of Culture and National Heritage and Sport. It will be presented by the Minister, Professor Piotr Bliński. And this prize goes to Mr. Martin Garcia Garcia. The second prize and 30,000 euros funded by the Speaker of the Sejm of the Republic of Poland and the Silver Medal. On behalf of the funder, the award will be presented by Ms. Małgorzata Gosiewska, Deputy Speaker of the Sejm of the Republic of Poland. Drawing for this prize are Mr. Aleksander Gadziew from Italy, Slovenia. And Mr. Kyohei Sorita from Japan. The first prize, accompanied by 40,000 euros, is funded by the President of the Republic of Poland and it comes with a gold medal. We have the great pleasure to invite to the stage the President of the Republic of Poland, Mr. Andrzej Duda. Mr. President, please present the first prize and the gold medal of the 18th International Frédéric Chopin Piano Competition, which goes to, ladies and gentlemen, it goes to Mr. Bruce Liu from Canada. Bruce Liu from Canada is the winner of the 18th International Frédéric Chopin Piano Competition. Mr. President, could we ask you to take the floor? Most distinguished members of the jury, dear winners, all of you distinguished ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Prime Minister, ministers, professors, all the distinguished guests who are present here in this hall. In 1927, when Professor Jerzy Żuravlew initiated the competition, the Chopin competition, the competition named after Frédéric Chopin was the time when 26 pianists from eight countries decided to compete. I don't believe that the professor could forecast that 
many, many years later, nearly 100 years later, there will be 500 people competing for the highest laurels of the Chopin competition, 500 young aficionados, experts and lovers of this music from practically all over the world. My heartfelt gratitude goes primarily to all the pianists who vied, who competed, to the artists, to the magnificent musicians who play Chopin in their everyday practice. Thank you very much for joining this tournament, for putting your heart into it, this great effort, huge emotions. I'd like to thank very warmly the most distinguished jury, all its members, ladies and Gentlemen, this last stage, 14 days, 2,000 interpretations of works by Friedrich Chopin, 100 hours if you put them end to end. That's how much music we listen to, to be able to stand here today and to present these prizes. After really hectic time and extremely difficult choice, choices that will be discussed for years and years, perhaps for more than just the period between the two Chopin competitions. But we'd like to thank for that magnificent work, because no one questions or challenges the winner. And therefore, the greater are my congratulations to the winner of the first prize. My heartfelt congratulations. Bravo. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, this first Chopin competition was aired live by radio. Since 1955, since the fifth Chopin competition, we had it on TV. Hardly anyone could see it because hardly anyone had a TV set at home, especially in Poland of the time. The 16th competition in 2010 was already broadcast over the internet. Today, these are millions of people who watch and who listen, millions of followers online for the successive stages of the preliminary and then all the stages up to the final. It's a great achievement for all the organizers of the Chopin competition, of all those who promote it. Thank you very much and I congratulate you from the depth of my heart. This magnificent event that you do, you do at the highest level and from the depth of your heart. I'd like to thank you very warmly for the effort you've put into that. But what I would like to say is we are so very proud that Chopin was a Pole, that he came from our country, that he walked this land, that he walked in this city. At the age of eight, he gave his first concert in Krakowski Przedmieście Street, in what today is the presidential palace. But can we say the same thing about the music of Chopin from our Polish point of view? Yes, because we can hear simply Poland in this music. When we hear this music, we see the Vistula River flowing. We see the willow trees bending over it. We see the rolling fields, so characteristic of our country, those characteristic Polish landscapes. But to tell you the truth, Chopin is a Pole, but his music today is not Polish music. Let's take a look at the young artists. They come from all over the world, and I am convinced that every one of them hears his own music in this. And playing, they, give, they offer their own interpretations of those magnificent works of Chopin. Today, perhaps you hear the maddening ocean where the sailors are fighting for the survival of their boat. Perhaps some lofty peaks you can hear in this music somewhere in the distant mountains. Perhaps this is wind in the trees that do not grow in Poland. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen,
Szanowni Państwo, Chopin jest Distinguished ladies artystą. and gentlemen, Chopin is a I Polish artist and I'm very glad of that and we're all very proud of that. Sometimes it's a problem for us. It gets on our nerves when somebody says he came from another country, but this is global music, world music, and it's a great reason for our pride. May I once again thank all the artists, all the pianists, especially the winners and the winner. Thank you for playing Chopin. Thank you for joining this competition. Thank you for being with us. Thank you for making his music and his name famous all over the world. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much, Mr. President. And by and by, ladies and gentlemen, we are concluding this part of the gala ceremony, a very much moving ceremony of the presentation of awards of the 18th International Frédéric Chopin Piano Competition. And uh, very soon, we are going to enjoy the winner's concert. But uh, uh, before we start the concert, we'll have a break. And before the break, we would like to take a family photo in the company of the members of the jury and of the pianists. So we would like to thank our wonderful finalists, our wonderful winners. Congratulations and thank you so much. Please join us on the stage to take a family photo. Sponsorem programu jest PKN Orlen, mecenas 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Wielkie chwile i wspólne emocje podczas 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Totalizator sportowy. Największy mecenas sportu i kultury. Grupa PZU partnerem 18. Konkursu Chopinowskiego. Wspierać kulturę to piękna sztuka. Sponsorem programu jest właściciel marki Lexus, partner Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Sponsorem programu jest Fabryka Cukiernicza Kopernik, partner 18. Konkursu Chopinowskiego. Miraculum SA, official partner and exclusive producer of Chopin perfumes, has the pleasure of inviting you to the Chopin competition. Amo con tutto il mio cuore. And I, I love Chopin with all my heart. <laughs> I love Chopin. <laughs> it's hard when you slept two hours, you know. I know. Yeah. So, but no, I, I love Chopin. I love Chopin. Me encanta Chopin. Oh, serdecznie dziękuję. <laughs> but this is just for Polish. For everybody, thank you so, so much from, from my heart. And it's been great that you've been following. Like, you are so many. And every time I saw the number of people following the live streams, I was, like, shocked. So, well done. <laughs> and thank you for following us in this incredible journey. The only thing I wanted to say after every single stage, every single stage, I said, 
I'm so sorry I cannot come out, you know, because everybody was so sweet, extremely sweet. Uh, everybody should know that I was so grateful, even messages sending, and I know people were writing in the chat, you know, whatever they were doing, <laughs> I don't know, and the audience in the hall also. Uh, there is no possibility to say thank you, heartful thank you to each one of you. It, it's just impossible, but I really want to say thank you to each and every one of you. It was uh, it was amazing, amazing reaction, amazing uh, warm feeling in the hall. It was it was just what you can dream of of a performance, you know. That's that's the ambiance, that's the environment that should be around music, and and you made it possible here. And <laughs> just thank you, everybody. So I, I sincerely, I really, I really want to thank all of you for the warm appreciation and the the support because already playing Chopin in Warsaw is really something special, and I know that. Uh, especially here, that all of you are really Chopin's music's experts in a way, and um, you know I think that's that's something really special that you cannot really find anywhere else. So I think, yeah, I sh I'm really grateful for all, all, all of you guys. Um, thank you so much for watching. I mean, it's really so amazing that so many people are here interested in this competition and that really love music, and it's just really gratifying that uh, to know that you're you're there watching. First of all, I want to say uh, thank you for supporting and uh, thank you for kindly comments. So uh, now I think uh, again, I again I think so. I want to learn more. More I want to know the how should I need to play Chopin, and uh, I want to know the more more Chopin's music. His life, uh, I do my best in my life, and uh, so the please following, following, in the future also, and uh, see you maybe in the world, your country. Uh, yes. So anyway, I want to say thank you so very much. Uh, my advice for young people who might be wanted to participate to the competition is to um, love music, to love the audience. Um, try not to um, think about the outcome of the competition. Um, when I decided to come back here, um, I did it, you know, um, without any expectations. And I, I think this is the best way to, you know, um, keep on track with the practicing, with the growth, because it's, it's happening when you take part in such a competition or also when, uh, even when you prepare for such a competition. Um, and then, you know, um, it's a discovery process and be open to, to anything. And I'd like uh, young people uh, to know, like people who are going to play in competition, to know that life doesn't start with a competition, doesn't end with a competition. Um, a competition is a wonderful opportunity uh, of concerts, of a career, but also for yourself. And this does not depend on the price. So be open to learn. You can listen to some of the performances to get an idea of what is going on, but don't listen to too many. Listen a lot to yourself while you practice. Record yourself. Try to see yourself. Um, try to actually see what you are doing. Be honest with yourself when you are, when you are practicing, when you are playing. So listen yourself from the outside, then forget completely and do the opposite, be completely involved in what you do. Uh, be very critical and very precise and then not at all and then just accept anything you do. And most importantly, find why you really love this music. Find a deep reason.
being a pianist, um, well, uh, of course the piano is something I love playing and meeting new people and uh, getting inspired by other fantastic pianists and um, just being able to learn and know about this music, uh, just like about music of these great composers is very inspiring. È stato molto speciale quando sono venuta qua la prima volta. Um, era come vivere un film. E vorrei ritrovare anche adesso un po' questa, questa sensazione. E, e, chiaramente non, non essendo la prima volta è comunque diverso dalla prima, però forse è più bello, forse è più bello, perché, perché sono tornata un po', un po a casa. Przyznam szczerze, że moim marzeniem było nie brać udziału w konkursie szopenowskim. Natomiast jakby im byłem starszy, wydaje mi się, że trochę też się zmienił mój profil e, pianisty. Zacząłem się bardziej interesować taką jakby poetyką dźwiękową. Wydaje mi się, że to był taki naturalny krok. Stwierdziłem, że jednak będąc Polakiem zawsze człowiek jest zmuszony grać dużo te, tego repertuaru e, Chopina, czy to na jakichś koncertach, czy na konkursach. Więc praktycznie cały repertuar mi się uzbierał, więc stwierdziłem, że czemu nie i po prostu spróbuję wziąć udział w konkursie. Six years ago, before the last Chopin competition, I was thinking of quitting the piano. And Chopin competition was there. So if there is no Chopin competition, I think I quit it. And my credit or a piano. So that's why Chopin is a very important composer for me. In my case, fue estuve en estuve en Nueva York eh, alrededor de un año durante la pandemia y básicamente solo. Y esa soledad ha hecho un, un gran avance en mi, en mi, en mi visión, en la concentración, en, en, en el entendimiento de algunos compositores en los cuales me, me he dedicado más a ellos, como ha sido Chopin. Entonces, eh, en mi caso, sí que ha sido, ha sido algo positivo. Por eso, por, por, por la soledad de, de tener el, el tiempo necesario para, para, para dedicar todo mi tiempo, el 100% del tiempo a... a, a Als composer is. Zo de instrument wat ik aan dan was, voor mij niet dat was piano dat. De piano was vroeger al leuk. De, waarom was ik leuk? Omdat ik me had bedacht, mijn hoofd en mijn hoofd had bedacht, de klank die ik had bedacht, de klank die ik had bedacht, was piano dat. こう悲しいと思ったら悲しい音が出るし、楽しいと思ったら楽しい音が出る。それが楽しくてピアノはずっと好きでした。その頃からまあショパンはずっと弾いてました、ね。I think I was very amused by the by the fact that you you feel you know you can control everything. Like you press a key and the sound comes out. It's very easy to make a sound on the piano. It's the easiest instrument to make a sound, by far. You just press it. But then it's uh, maybe one of the most difficult to shape everything. And I liked probably this, uh, yeah, the ability to, to share different voices at the same time. So polyphony. I'm Bruce Chow Yi Liu and from Canada. With the pandemic, I was able to have a, a more inner, uh, peaceful mind, you know. I was really like, uh, I mean, we couldn't do much outside. So I was able to actually, you know, found um, more details in my music actually. And that usually probably I wouldn't have that deeply. And the, I just tried to do my best, you know, the rest is like, go with the flow. 
Actually, that audition was my first public performance since like more than one year, yeah. I think what makes it really unique is that uh, there's a huge Chopin fans uh, around the, that follows really closely the competition. So, and they're actually really experts sometimes, you know? So it's like in being able to be um, attracted or maybe they hate you, maybe they like you, but it doesn't really matter. You know, the quality or the level of understanding of Chopin's music is there. You have this kind of, you know, that so many passionate people are around you. So I think that's what makes it really special. It's just like, I was thinking, how can I improve more, you know? And maybe the way to improve it is actually to leave it a bit. Yeah, it's not, you know, like you always practice and there's, uh, you know, it's like life, you know, you don't always practice. It's like you can go to a bar, you know, you can chill out with friends or whatever. So it's, and you know, you can also do something else than just piano practicing. That actually helps you. I mean, for me. <laughs> Probably keep the freshness, keep the inspiration, keep the creativity. Always have some new um, ideas. And at the same time, it's something that it's also really ple pleasant, you know, because you ha you are, you're not bored of yourself because you always play the same thing, but you can still find a different uh, way of playing. I started piano not so early, so... At the beginning, it was really like a hobby, uh, as many other hobbies I also had. And you know, with time, uh, it becomes more, let's say, a way of expressing, you know, expressing emotions for me. I think I will, this feeling will get stronger if I get uh, even older, uh, yeah. Because you really feel that you're like in your own world and you forget really about everything else when you, when you play or practice. And Piano is a very special instrument because, you know, it's not like the other instrument that you bring yourself. Every time, you know, you play a concert is a different piano. So, um, I mean, it's a fun thing because you have different experiences. But at the same time, it's a, it's a challenging, uh, challenging thing because you have to adapt yourself to it. Sometimes, I don't know if that's a good example, but I think about, you know, like, different pianos, it's like you're having <laughs> different girlfriends all the time, you know, uh, and have, I don't know, multiple lovers, you know. So it's like, it's a, it's a good thing maybe, but it's also a tough thing. So, but don't worry, I'm a, I'm a good boy, so. <laughs> Sponsorem programu jest PKN Orlen, mecenas 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Wielkie chwile i wspólne emocje podczas 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Totalizator sportowy, największy mecenas sportu i kultury. Grupa PZU partnerem 18. Konkursu Chopinowskiego. Wspierać kulturę to piękna sztuka. Sponsorem programu jest właściciel marki Lexus, partner Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Sponsorem programu jest Fabryka Cukiernicza Kopernik, partner 18. Konkursu Chopinowskiego. Miraculum SA, official partner and exclusive producer of Chopin Perfumes, has the pleasure of inviting you to the Chopin competition. Thank you. 
Dobry wieczór, witamy Państwa ponownie i z ogromną przyjemnością zapraszamy na koncert laureatów 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Witamy widzów i witamy publiczność zgromadzoną tutaj w Teatrze Wielkim Operze Narodowej. W tej części wieczoru, w tej części wieczoru usłyszymy solowe występy laureatów nagród od 6 do 2. A jako pierwszy wystąpi? Laureat nagrody 6. JJ Jun Lee Bui, Kanada. W jego interpretacji usłyszymy etiudę Edur, opus 10, numer 3. JJ Jun Lee Bui. Zapraszamy.
To był występ laureata szóstej nagrody tegorocznej edycji konkursu Chopinowskiego. A w Warszawie trwa cały czas wielkie święto muzyki, muzyki Fryderyka Chopina. Już za chwilę na tej scenie pojawi się laureatka nagrody piątej, Leonora Armelini, Włochy. W jej interpretacji usłyszymy Sostenuto Walca s -dur oraz Balladę as -dur, opus 47 oczywiście, Fryderyka Chopina. Zapraszamy, Leonora Armelini.
Leonora Armelini, laureatka piątej nagrody na tegorocznej edycji konkursu Chopinowskiego. Drodzy Państwo, już za chwilę na tej scenie wystąpi kolejna dwójka niezwykle utalentowanych młodych pianistów, zdobywców, laureatów czwartej nagrody w 18 Międzynarodowym Konkursie Pianistycznym imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Jako pierwszy pojawi się Jakub Kuszlik, Polska, która jednocześnie przypomnę, jest także laureatem nagrody za najlepsze wykonanie Mazurków. I w jego interpretacji właśnie Mazurki Fryderyka Chopina, opus 30, pierwszy cemol, drugi hamol, trzeci desdur i czwarty cis. Mol przed Państwem Jakub Kuszlik.
Jakub Kuszlik, laureat czwartej nagrody. Przepiękne Mazurki w jego wykonaniu. Drodzy Państwo, laureatką czwartej nagrody jest również pianistka z Japonii, Aimi Kobayashi. W jej interpretacji usłyszymy wybrane z cyklu preludiów opus 28, kolejne numery 4, 16, 17, 23 i 24 przed Państwem Aimi Kobayashi. Zapraszamy.
Kobayashi.
Aimi Kobayashi, Japonia, laureatka czwartej nagrody. Drodzy Państwo, muzyka Fryderyka Chopina jest także słuchana, podziwiana i uwielbiana w ojczyźnie laureata trzeciej nagrody. Zresztą jest uwielbiana i kochana właściwie na całym świecie, ale także w Hiszpanii, bo stamtąd pochodzi laureat trzeciej nagrody tegorocznej edycji konkursu Chopinowskiego. Martin Garcia Garcia. A w jego interpretacji dwa utwory Fryderyka Chopina. Impromptu Gesdur opus 51 i Walc Asdur opus 34 numer pierwszy. I teraz czas na brawa. Martin Garcia Garcia.
Martin Garcia Garcia, laureat trzeciej nagrody. Czas, drodzy Państwo, teraz na laureatów nagrody drugiej. Tę nagrodę otrzymała dwójka utalentowanych pianistów. Jako pierwszy na tej scenie pojawi się pianista japoński Kyohei Sorita. Rondo Alamazur Mazur Fdur Opus V to utwór, który usłyszymy w interpretacji laureata nagrody drugiej. Zapraszamy. Thank you. 
Kio Hei Sorita, laureat drugiej nagrody. Zdobył ją ex -equo z innym równie utalentowanym i wybitnym pianistą, Aleksandrem Gadiewem, który reprezentuje Włochy i Słowenię. W interpretacji Aleksandra Gadiewa usłyszymy poloneza Fismol opus 44. Zapraszamy.
Aleksandr Gadiew, laureat drugiej nagrody. Proszę Państwa, za nami występy solowe tej części koncertu laureatów. Poznaliśmy laureatów nagród od szóstej do drugiej. Przyznają Państwo, że wszyscy są absolutnie niezwykle utalentowani. Jesteśmy przekonani, że już odnieśli ogromny sukces, zostając laureatami międzynarodowego konkursu pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina i że wspaniała przyszłość przed nimi. Laureat pierwszej nagrody wystąpi ze wspaniałą orkiestrą symfoniczną Filharmonii Narodowej pod batutą Andrzeja Borejki, ale na tę część naszego galowego koncertu zaprosimy Państwa po przerwie. Do usłyszenia i do zobaczenia już niebawem. Sponsorem programu jest PKN Orlen, mecenas 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Wielkie chwile i wspólne emocje podczas 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Totalizator sportowy, największy mecenas sportu i kultury. Grupa PZU partnerem 18. Konkursu Chopinowskiego. Wspierać kulturę to piękna sztuka. Sponsorem programu jest właściciel marki Lexus, partner Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Sponsorem programu jest Fabryka Cukiernicza Kopernik, partner 18. Konkursu Chopinowskiego. Miraculum SA, official partner and exclusive producer of Chopin Perfumes, has the pleasure of inviting you to the Chopin competition. and the winner of this year's Chopin competition. Hello, my name is Alexander Gadziev and I have won the second prize and the Christian Zimmerman prize for the best performance of a sonata. 
Uh, yes, I'm Kyohei Sarita. Hey everyone, this is uh, Kyohei Sarita. Uh, I was born uh, in Japan, Tokyo, and uh, I wanted to be a football player, <laughs> but now I'm pianist. Uh, fortunately, I got prize, second prize of the grateful competition. International Chopin Competition. Nazywam się Kup Kuszlik. Otrzymałem czwartą nagrodę na konkursie szpanowskim. I am Martin Garcia Garcia and I am the third prize winner of the Chopin Piano Competition. It's Leonora Armellini here from Italy, um, Padva, and uh, yesterday I got the fifth prize in the Chopin Competition. My name is JJ Bui and I received sixth prize. I feel complete in a way. I feel that um, one of the greatest achievements of my life has been reached and I feel I can breathe more deeply. Um, strange. I feel strange uh, right now. Um, I, I still have to realize what's what happened in the past month. Um, it's been something so huge and so beautiful and so incredible. Um, I think never in my life I've, I've experienced so many feelings all at once. So I have to process. <laughs> well, just uh, dazzled, actually. It's, <laughs> it's actually the same day. We, we managed to sleep a little bit, uh, everybody, but <laughs> not so much. So, so it is uh, dazzling. Of course, very happy uh, after, the, after the results and uh, after the, the good feeling that we had in the right before the the results with all the all the uh, all the finalists it was it was very nice really i'm very happy for everyone so i'm just really tired <laughs> but of course this uh i cannot hide this happiness of course and this uh, uh you know in my mind it's still like uh, so full of emotions i cannot find the right words to describe it and but at the same time, you know, I'm not worried, but, you know, I feel this huge privilege, but also this huge responsibility, you know, to to really be this winner, to, because to, to be able to continue, you know, all these projects and all these plans that's ahead of me, and to be able to still find this inspiration and freshness in music will be a, a very big challenge. And, well, I'm excited for this new adventure coming. Uh, I am extremely happy to be in the final stage, let, no, let alone win a prize. So it's really a real honor to be here. As I called my teacher and my and my family, you know, all the my close the closest person, and uh, well, they actually when I called them, they all know the results already. But it's just to you know to to share this and to you know to finally explode a bit of myself after all the preparations that we have done together, yeah. Uh, I, I didn't call anybody yesterday after the results. It was too late. I just wanted people to sleep. <laughs> and I have to, to call them yet. And they are gonna be my mom, my dad, my professor, and a couple of really close friends. And yeah, those were the people that I've been calling after any round here. And yeah, I... I will call them shortly. <laughs> no, I was with my brother and with my with my girlfriend, and you know, I was <laughs> was so happy for everything that. I mean, poor my mother. I'm sure she was waiting my call. <laughs> uh, I didn't really call anyone because I had like close people in the hall. Actually, my father was there uh, with my manager from Italy. And uh, also some of my closest friends were uh, in the hall. So I felt like, let's say, what I needed in the moment was already there. You are
playing and meeting new people and、uh, getting inspired by other fantastic pianists and、um, just being able to learn and know about this music,、uh, just like about music of these great composers, is very inspiring. È stato molto speciale quando sono venuta qua la prima volta.、Um, era come vivere un film. E vorrei ritrovare anche adesso un po' questa questa sensazione. E, e, chiaramente non, non essendo la prima volta è comunque diverso dalla prima, però forse è più bello. Forse è più bello perché perché sono tornata un po' un po' a casa. Przyznam szczerze, że moim marzeniem było nie brać udziału w konkursie szopenowskim. Natomiast, jakby im byłem starszy, wydaje mi się, że trochę też się zmienił mój profil、e, pianisty. Zacząłem się bardziej interesować taką jakby poetyką dźwiękową. Wydaje mi się, że to był taki naturalny krok. Stwierdziłem, że jednak będąc Polakiem, zawsze człowiek jest zmuszony grać dużo te, tego repertuaru、e, Chopina, czy to na jakichś koncertach, czy na konkursach. więc praktycznie cały repertuar mi się uzbierał, więc stwierdziłem, że czemu nie i po prostu spróbuję wziąć udział w konkursie. Six years ago, before the last Chopin competition, I was thinking of quitting the piano, and Chopin competition was there. So if there no Chopin competition, I think I quitted. I might quit it or a piano, so that's why Chopin is a very important composer for me. In my case, fue estuve en estuve en Nueva York、eh, alrededor de un año durante la pandemia y básicamente solo. y esa soledad ha hecho un, un gran avance en mi en mi en mi visión en la concentración en, en en el entendimiento de algunos compositores en los cuales me he, me he dedicado más a ellos como ha sido Chopin entonces、eh, en mi caso sí que ha sido ha sido algo positivo por eso por por, por la soledad de, de tener el el tiempo necesario para 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 dedicar todo mi tiempo el cien por cien del tiempo a, a, a Los compositores. そこでインストゥルメントを選んだのは僕にとってはピアノだったでピアノは昔から好きでしてでなんで好きかっていうと自分がこう考えた頭の中で考えた音イメージした音を実際に具現化できるのがピアノだった。こう悲しいと思ったら悲しい音が出るし、楽しいと思ったら楽しい音が出る。それが楽しくてピアノはずっと好きでした。その頃からまあショパンはずっと弾いてましたね。I think I was very amused by the by the fact that you you feel you know you can control everything. Like you press a key and the sound comes out. It's very easy to make a sound on the piano. It's the easiest instrument to make a sound, by far. You just press it. But then it's、uh, maybe one of the most difficult to shape everything. And I liked probably this,、uh, yeah, the ability to to share different voices at the same time. So polyphony. I'm Bruce Chowy Liu, and from Canada. With the pandemic, I was able to have a, a more inner,、uh, peaceful mind. You know, I was really like,、uh, I mean, we couldn't do much outside, so I was able to actually, you know, found、um, more details in my music actually, and that usually probably I wouldn't have that deeply. And the, I just tried to do my best. You know, the rest is like go with the flow. Actually, that audition was my first public performance since like 
more than one year, yeah. I think what makes it really unique is that uh, there's a huge Chopin fans uh, around the, that follows really closely the competition. So, and they're actually really experts sometimes, you know? So it's like in being able to be um, attracted or maybe they hate you, maybe they like you, but it doesn't really matter. You know, the quality or the level of understanding of Chopin's music is there. You have this kind of, you know, that so many passionate people are around you. So I think that's what makes it really special. It's just like, I, I was thinking, how can I improve more, you know? And maybe the way to improve it is actually to leave it a bit. Yeah, it's not, you know, like you always practice and there's, uh, you know, it's like life, you know, you don't always practice. It's like you can go to a bar, you know, you can chill out with friends or whatever. So it's. And, you know, you can also do something else than just piano practicing. That actually helps you. I mean, for me. <laughs> Probably keep the freshness, keep the inspiration, keep the creativity. Always have some new um, ideas. And at the same time, it's something that it's also really ple pleasant, you know, because you ha you are, you're not bored of yourself because you always play the same thing, but you can still find different uh, way of playing. I started piano not so early. So at the beginning, it was really like a hobby, uh, as many other hobbies I also had. And you know, with time, uh, it becomes more, let's say, a way of expressing, you know, expressing emotions for me. I think I'll, this feeling will get stronger if I get uh, even older, uh, yeah. Because you really feel that you're like in your own world and you forget really about everything else when you, when you play or practice. And piano is a very special instrument because you know, it's not like the other instrument that you bring yourself. Every time you, know, you play a concert is a different piano. So, um, I mean, it's a fun thing because you have different experiences, but at the same time, it's a, it's a challenging, uh, challenging thing because you have to adapt yourself to it. Sometimes I don't know if that's a good example, but I think about you know like different pianos. It's like you're having <laughs> different girlfriends all the time, you know, uh, and have I don't know multiple lovers, you know. So it's like it's a, it's a good thing maybe, but it's also a tough thing. So. But don't worry, I'm a, I'm a good boy, so... <laughs> Sponsorem programu jest PKN Orlen, mecenas 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Wielkie chwile i wspólne emocje podczas 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Totalizator sportowy, największy mecenas sportu i kultury. Grupa PZU partnerem 18. konkursu Chopinowskiego. Wspierać kulturę to piękna sztuka. Sponsorem programu jest właściciel marki Lexus, partner międzynarodowego konkursu pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Sponsorem programu jest Fabryka Cukiernicza Kopernik, partner 18. konkursu Chopinowskiego. Miraculum SA, official partner and exclusive producer of Chopin Perfumes, has the pleasure of inviting you to the Chopin competition.
To jest wyjątkowy wieczór w Teatrze Wielkim Operze Narodowej w Warszawie. Trwa koncert laureatów 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Witamy Państwa bardzo serdecznie. Witamy widzów, witamy publiczność i witamy Orkiestrę Symfoniczną w Filharmonii Narodowej. Hello. Przed nami ostatni już pianista dzisiejszego wieczoru, laureat pierwszej nagrody, który wykona koncert Emol op. 11 Fryderyka Chopina, części utworu Allegro Maestoso, romanca Larghetto i Rondo Vivace. Orkiestra Symfoniczna Filharmonii Narodowej pod batutą maestro Andrzeja Borejki, a solistą będzie laureat pierwszej nagrody na 18 Międzynarodowym pianist Konkursie Pianistycznym imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Bruce Liu.
Sponsorem programu był PKN Orlen, mecenas 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Wielkie chwile i wspólne emocje podczas 18. Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Totalizator sportowy. Największy mecenas sportu i kultury. Grupa PZU partnerem 18. Konkursu Chopinowskiego. Wspierać kulturę to piękna sztuka. Sponsorem programu był właściciel marki Lexus, partner Międzynarodowego Konkursu Pianistycznego imienia Fryderyka Chopina. Sponsorem programu była fabryka cukiernicza Kopernik, partner 18. Konkursu Chopinowskiego. Miraculum SA, official partner and exclusive producer of Chopin perfumes, has the pleasure of inviting you to the Chopin competition.